Hello guys, uh, I have trouble with my Mazda 3 2012 brakes. So I went ahead and opened my brake master cylinder. So I thought I should show you guys what I found. Uh, it's actually very interesting. So I of course went ahead and removed the top uh, bottle looking thing they have here. So it's basically like a screw that goes in here. And then once you remove the screw, the whole bottle comes out. And this is actually a lower cylinder that you're looking right here uh, and this is the internal part so that's where they say you know replace the cylinder so I wanted to actually see what exactly break I found a lot of YouTube videos where people are uh, showing this internal rubber that breaks but mine look in great condition that they're both of them looks good now there's one more piece inside I cannot take this out and I know they say just hit it hard I tried like several times it does not come out I even use a hammer hit it here it doesn't come out I also blow some air here it just does not come out it's like stuck but I can press it so it, it does seems to go down down now the strange thing is it was extremely open for me to uh, extremely hard for me to open and the reason is so of course you can put this inside here you can see Oops. This is it. Yep, so this piece going here well I cannot get it out Let's go like this. There you go. So here you can basically press it like normal brakes. See? And I can also feel like a pressure here when I put my fingers on these and I press this thing, I can actually feel the pressure coming out. So it was, it's really hard for me to buy a new one or used one or you know whatever I wanna buy, but it's really hard for me to replace it when I can clearly see it. there is no really sign of bad thing. And of course I didn't see any video of sh anyone showing a Mazda 3 one open like this. And now the crazy thing is this is like a seal they use on the corner and there is really no like those two holes that you can hold with a plier. They, they kind of make it in a way that you cannot open this thing. It, it was nearly impossible. So I basically used like a diamond blade and made like a tiny cut on the corner. And then I basically put like a screwdriver and it was pretty hard for me to like open it. And now of course I have to fight back and forth to get this thing inside. So to me, it seems to work completely normal. If I see this rubber inside cut it or any, any damage piece, I would be happy to replace it, the whole thing. But I don't see any damage in my uh, master brake cylinder. So I just don't see why I should replace it and just waste some money. So I thought I should show you guys, you know, what I found and how it looks like from inside. Uh, again, a lot of people shows me it's super easy to re remove, but I had extreme trouble to remove the screws from here. They were super tight. They would not come out. I even used plier, you know, it was it was few hours worth of work before I got it out but everything else was super easy to remove um, but yeah anyway let me know if you guys have any comment for me uh, thank you for watching